Hello friends, I want to introduce you to something special that you're going to get as a gift from St. Matthew's United Methodist Church for you and your family. It's called Advent in a Box and you're going to get a box that looks like this. Your box though will have this sticker attached so it's sealed so that when you go to open it, you're gonna to have to tear open the seal. But the box, the seal says open on November 29th. You could open it before that as long as you keep track of the pieces, but you wanna have it open for sure by the 29th of November, okay? Because you're gonna do some special activities using what's in the box. All right, so I'm gonna open the box up so you can see what's in your box. The first thing you're gonna see is a welcome to Advent box. And the Welcome to Advent box includes um, your What is Advent? It tells you about Advent. It's more for the grown-ups to tell you the things that you can do. It's gonna tell them if there's any special supplies you need, which you don't need much. Just household things like a pen or colored pencils, some milk, um, some dish soap, some matches or a lighter. And then um, in the box, you're also gonna find for each week, there'll be scriptures for the week. There'll be a sheet that says hands-on activity. There will be a page that says interactive prayer activity. And then there'll be a page that says Emmanuel, God with us. And one of our um, songs of Advent is O Come, O Come, Emmanuel. So each week, they'll talk about um, that song, okay? So you'll have activities to do. It'll include things, um, there'll be some a paper chain that you can be making throughout Advent. And then there will be, so you'll have one of those for each, or a set of papers for each week. So this is week two, week three is green, week four is red. And then you're gonna have something, it's an instructions on how to make an advent spiral. And I'm gonna show you how that works in just a minute. And then in your box, you're gonna see, you're gonna have two packages of Model Magic. One and two. There you go, oh, upside down, two. You're gonna have some interesting things like these little strips, they're gonna be turned into something really cool. You're gonna really like it. But I don't wanna give away all the secrets, so this is something really cool that'll be fun. You're gonna have this baggie. These are called the building flakes. Mm, let's see what we end up doing with those. You're gonna have a bag of rock salt. Huh, I wonder what we'll do with rock salt. I don't know. You're gonna have a bag of stars. That's gonna go with the Model Magic. It's got a special job. You're gonna have these guys. They're called color fizzes. And you're gonna have, there you have a special job. You're gonna have a piece of purple construction paper. Ooh, that's gonna go with your Model Magic and your stars. You're gonna have some Alka-Seltzer tablets. Hmm. You're gonna have a little bottle like a film canister. You're gonna have a, a Q-tip. And your last thing is hiding from me. Oh wait, there's a candle. That's gonna go along with your stars and your model magic. And there's another candle. It looks like a birthday candle. I wonder what we're gonna do with that. So those are all the things are in your box and I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with the model magic. So hold on. Okay, friends, so you're going to take that model magic that you have. You've got two packages, so you want to put them together. So you can still see it's a little separated. You know, you're going to work with it just like you do with Play-Doh. I know you know how to do that. So work with your model magic. And what you're going to need is to measure, is to roll out a snake. That's always fun. So you're just going to work with the model magic just like you normally would with Play-Doh or whatever. And roll it and roll it and roll it until you get a snake that is 25 inches long. And so I'm gonna work with it and I'm gonna come back and show you what it looks like. In just a second. Okay friends, so the next thing you need is you need that purple piece of construction paper that's in your box. And you're gonna take your snake and you are going to loop him around and make spiral with him so that he fits on your 8x8 eight eight piece of construction paper 
Now your spiral, you might want to make a little different than mine. You can do it however you want. It's your spiral to do with as you want, but you want to have it circle around. Now the one thing is you want to make sure that you have um, a space in the middle because you are going to stick, um, you're going to put your candle in there. And um, so let me grab your candle so you can see. All right, so guys, now you can see I've got my advent spiral all done. Um, it is going to sit and get dry and wait for the 1st of December. Um, and I hope you enjoy making your spiral and that you enjoy putting your stars on and waiting and counting down as a family to Christmas. It's ready for the first day.